what is BTT, what will happen to BitTorrent on February the 11th and how can you get free BTT airdrops. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco here and in today's video I'll be analysing BitTorrent BTT in a fundamental point of view guys and then I'll be talking about the airdrop of BTT that's going to happen on February the 11th and finally guys I'll be talking about the price and how how the price might be affected uh, with this airdrop and do a technical analysis of BTT also guys at the end of the video I'll be talking about some of the trades that I've been taking you can watch on my YouTube some of the old coins that we've been trading and cryptocurrency and Bitcoin is popping it's, it's really good to trade almost all the coins are up if you go on coin market cap so I'll be and Analyzing and talking about some of my trades and some some of the subscribers trades because some of my subscribers have been making money as well on YouTube and people have been commenting so guys without further ado let's get into the video so BitTorrent I assume you all know what BitTorrent is and um, it's a decentralized network space uh, even before Bitcoin was here but it wasn't really monetized from what my understanding is BitTorrent wasn't really making that much money so Tron came in and bought BitTorrent for 140 million and with BTT token they have raised a lot of money so I'll be talking about the finance and the token economics you know in a bit but this is basically what it is and according to BitTorrent paper BTT will incentivize users to offer infrastructure services such as seeding or hosting files in return for BTT. I have had a look at the bit, uh, the BitTorrent white paper. It goes into some of the technical details, which is probably too in depth um, for myself and to talk about talk about it in this YouTube video. If people are interested, I'm happy to go through the white paper. But it is a long document. It talks about the tech. It goes into the technical bits. BitTorrent speed. I will cover it in a bit, which is something that I will talk about. Um, that's something the Tron and BitTorrent are trying to do to incentivize people to use BitTorrent and get BTT. The most importantly, guys, I'll talk about the token economics. So it's a giant leap in file sharing, but I mean, I don't know how much change Tron's going to do to BitTorrent because uh, we know what BitTorrent is. It's a free service which we've been using for a while. Um, but if you think about it, guys, what do we use BitTorrent for? And a lot of what BitTorrent is used for is is probably not illegal, uh, not legal as much because there's a lot of copyrighted uh, documents, uh, music, movies that get shared so uh, the the legal side of things is a bit could be a bit sketchy uh, but they're trying to use BTT they're gonna um, be launching in, in this second quarter of this year which will enable faster downloads and they're hoping that people will pay for it but what files will, will be shared are they gonna be sharing because the copyright is a big issue how are they gonna solve that that's one of the red marks for me for for BitTorrent the token I don't really see how this is gonna add value is this is a long-term prediction I mean I'll talk about price in a bit because this is two different things I try to separate my analysis so uh, general decentralized mass distribution you can read it or read this yourself the key bit that I want to talk to you about is the Tron foundation token allocation so as you can see guys a lot of it is um, is going to be private sellers partnership is going to be held by Tron foundation the BitTorrent ecosystem the team and you won't be getting a lot so the public sale is six percent and you know the Tron uh, holders will get about ten percent so the the supply is going to increase a lot so the, there's obviously that's going to have an effect on the price when when more BTT gets uh, put into the ecosystem. Uh, this talks about the public um, token sale that happened and that Bi uh, Binance had a big part to play in it. So BNB, 40% of tokens were in sale of BNB. So the team, we already know what the team is, guys. Um, it's BitTorrent and the Tron team. So one thing, uh, so yeah, this is what I want to talk to you about. Initial circulating supply is only 9%, but it will be about 80% within the 3.5 years. And this massive inflationary pressure would definitely have an effect on the price. Unless BTT keeps growing, I don't see the, how the price can keep going up and up with 80% supply so that is one of the key things I wanted to talk to you about no details of lockups or vestings for team tokens seed and investor private bonus got 68% bonus which is quite higher um, which is not great obviously there's a legal element which I talked about 
there are some potential as well there's a lot of people already using it tokenizing it a uh, large network effects of bitcoin can have a play the whole cryptocurrency and bitcoin market might be going up so there are some positives as well and i'm not just talking about negatives so they've rated the five out of ten the key deal breaker for me for investing in it long term is this 80 percent uh, potential supply increasing and then some of the benefits private investors have got it's the same in stock market guys um which is, makes it really difficult for us um normal investors and um, another thing that this guy didn't talk about is um tron bought btt for 140 million if we go and check the market cap of btt now let me find where it is just look for it it's, it's all green if you can see guys it's all green today the market cap is 127 uh, million so it's, it's still less than what they paid for but if you look at the total supply it's a lot lot higher they're not sure about the circulating supply just yet so that's something to keep in mind if um, if the investors are, are to make money from what they've paid for the price will go up a lot but the supply will increase so it's like a catch-22 so what will what will happen that's why you need to understand technical analysis and and be up to date with all the news and what's going on in the market and um, so yeah they bought it for 140 120 million so the market cap is similar to what they paid for so that's something to keep it keep in mind so airdrop i'm sure most of you are here to see how how most of you uh, learned how are you going to get the airdrops so f february 11th is the first time they'll be doing the airdrop and it will be going up to 2025 so on february 11th if the airdrop is a significant amount of btt people are going to dump it and if they dump it the price of btt will go down because there's going to be supply increase people will be selling it and demand and supply the price will go down that is how i am seeing it and a um, lot of people would say the same thing as well um, and if you look at the btt price now let me go in go into btt price i'll talk about one of the trades that i took in btt so whole cryptocurrency market is going up and up but btt has not had a pump which is quite significant to see BTT that it's not got a pump. It's 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 a good level. That is a key resistance level I've drawn as a red box. I've I've had it for a while. It's a 200 hourly moving average as well. So it has found some support, but it's not really going up. And when we see a uh, price action where something just goes up and then sideways and it can't go higher or it does this or does this kind of ledge kind of thing it's not really good uh, it's not good price action and it is a bearish price action so so if the cryptocurrency market has a pullback which i think bitcoin uh, litecoin has gone up so much there will be a small pullback it can have, have an effect on the btt price if people dump it it can fall back to around this level but i think there will be another um price higher for btt and so that's one thing to keep that in mind we need to understand how much of uh, btt will be dropped so bitcoin airdrop let's look into the finer details so what is the exactly the btt the partnership between bitcoin and tron created tron trc 10 dub btt and 10 percent will be given over over five six years uh binance one thing people have been asking me will binance support the drop yes they will you can see that they will be supporting it uh, updates to updates to bitcoin token sale events how does one qualify so you, if your coins are on a binance exchange you will be getting it tens of cryptocurrency exchanges and wallets announce their intentions to su support the much awaited airdrop making it one of the most popular airdrops in recent times if you want to qualify for free btt have only two conditions to fulfill namely hold some amount of torrent uh, of tron and ensure that your trx is stored in a crypto exchange or a wallet that supports btt airdrop so it's quite simple if you are doing that you will get your btt airdrop so that is how to get your btt airdrops and binance will be supporting it which is 
I assume a lot of my subscribers are uh, trade so Binance will be supporting it so that is what, how I'm seeing the price of BTT you saw me take a trade and I did take profits um, at 10% and at 20% and the reason for taking profits is it didn't make new higher high and it didn't even hold this level that would have been a really strong anchor and it broke it and what's kind of annoying is that all the crypt, crypt, rest of the cryptocurrency market is going up but Tron and um, BTT have not gone up as much if you look at Litecoin which we've been trading for a while um, it's just gone crazy it's gone massively up I'm a bit disappointed because I had an order here to buy some more and it missed by just I think less than a couple of percent less than a half a percent I missed that 23 points I missed my Litecoin entry otherwise I would have got some more Litecoin I went to sleep otherwise I probably would have bought it if I was awake at that price but that was my zone I was looking at on the hourly you'll see it far too clearly it didn't touch my zone otherwise I would have got some now it's looking for a pullback you can see the the upward trend is um, gone sideways so if if people if cryptocurrency market is so buoyant and so bullish and altcoins like most altcoins are going up on had a massive up massive massive jump uh, on's been doing quite well theta I've tweeted about this on my on my um I talked about it in my previous YouTube video and I've tweeted about Theta as well because that's a coin that I was looking to buy that was uh, 19 hours ago I talked about Theta and that has just gone berserk as well so we've been making really good money but if, if cryptocurrency and altcoins are so bullish then when people get BTT do you think they'll sell their BTT and jump into a shinier coin that is something that can happen which will again drop the price of BTT so nearer to the next airdrop the price might go up but I'm, I think the price could go down uh, for this I don't think it will just crash to zero or it will just uh, go down a lot but there will be a bit of a pullback in BTT so that is my thoughts guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video some of the zones I'll be looking at would be here and there so I saw some below when it broke the red zone and now it's got finding support here and the next support is another 18-20% below so if it doesn't hold this support then it could probably come down to here but it needs to hold this support guys this is a very strong support this is where it broke up and um, it broke up touchdown so there's this is the really strong support so it needs to hold this level pardon me it needs to hold this level so that is what I'll be looking at guys if there is a BTT dump that is just my thoughts I'm not looking to buy any more BTT I haven't got any BTT now of I've sold it. You can go back on my Twitter feed or just watch the YouTube video. The previous two YouTube videos are made about BTT. I talk about this trade and I talk when I bought it, when I traded it. So these are not, I'm not just saying it. I do actually take this trade and I've shared it with you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you have enjoyed it, guys, you know what to do. Smash that like button, subscribe to my channel. And if you have any questions about BTT, any cryptocurrency or my technical analysis, just send me an email. I've been quite busy, so I've not had a chance to look at my emails, but I will look at it over the weekend and get back to you. If you want any mentoring or any questions about technical analysis and trading, feel free to email me, guys, and I'll try and help you out. My email is in the descriptions. Um, so you can find my email address there or just comment on this YouTube video. I don't sell courses or try and... Um, uh, so I'd really appreciate if you guys could just subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button that would help me out a lot uh, if you get any value out of it I'd really appreciate if you smash that like button subscribe to my channel and kindly turn the notification button on also guys if you want to be in with chance a chance of winning $250 worth of XRP smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button and leave your XRP address below to win potentially $250 worth of xrp in my next giveaway so thank you very much guys i hope you've enjoyed it what are your thoughts on btt what do you think about my analysis and do you think this airdrop will have an effect on the price hope this has given you a clue on how to get your btt airdrop you don't want to be missing free airdrops if you own tron so make sure you do this to get your free BTT airdrops as well so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button comment below on your thoughts on BTT Tron and if you have any questions 
email me and um, contact me on Twitter on YouTube and I'll try and get back to you so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much